Hey, what's up guys? I'm Saxon Tech and today's video is about the Samsung Galaxy S6 reveal along with the HCC M9, which is coming out at NCW 2015 in Barcelona, Spain, which a lot of people are going to be flying over there to do some full coverage. So let's get right into the information to talk about the Samsung Galaxy S6. <music> The Galaxy S6 is coming out in March and we're not sure when it's going to be but it's already coming out next month or so be expecting that so when the release date will be. So first thing let's talk about simple is just the color because it's just pretty simple to understand. It's coming out in black, gold, blue and white. That's it. So the Galaxy S5 thickness was at an 8.6 and now the Samsung Galaxy X6 is running at a 7.2 which would be a lot more smoother for your hand to get a good grip on it. So the Samsung Galaxy S6 is running at a 5.0 Super AMOLED display with a resolution of 1440 by 2650 and a slowly PPI of destiny points of 587. Now some of you are just saying that it's going to be decreasing but some people don't actually really see the really big difference, big deal of it. But all of you, if you seem to have a problem with that, please leave a comment down below and tell me what exactly why is it are you actually disappointed about that. Either way, the Samsung Galaxy S6 is going to be protected by a Corning Gorilla Glass 4 with TouchWiz and also you're going to be seeing the same capacitive button on the same phone with like the Samsung Galaxy S5 and plus the fingerprint as well. So let's talk about what's coming under the hood on the Samsung Galaxy S6. So far, Qualcomm Snapdragon processor A10 has been having some sort of a problem on the overheating system that has actually been burning up the phones. So they have lost their biggest client and it was supposed to be on the Samsung Galaxy S6. So right now we are running at an Exynos 7420 octave core and a quad core of 1.9 and a quad core of 1.8 and a Mali T760 GPU with a RAM of 3 gigabytes on the phone and the internal storage is only up to is 32 gigabytes and no more 16. At this current moment, I'm starting to like what's going on right now. So, so far, everybody's gonna have enough massive storage into their phone and you can also put an external of 128 of gigabytes inside of your phone as well. So the next one on this list is the camera and you're gonna see a big change about this one. So the rear camera is coming at a 20 megapixel which is also great for 4K resolution when you wanna shoot outside on the screen. And also in the front facing camera is coming at a five megapixel. So the next thing on this list is the design. So, so far I've been completely impressed this year with the Samsung company which is coming out with the Alpha which it looks a little bit mediocre but that's okay. And then you have the Edge, the Samsung Galaxy Note and the Galaxy S5 which is pretty completely impressive that the S5 is the only thing that can have go through water and is completely water resistant and, I, and dust as well which is IP67. But so far saying that the Samsung Galaxy S6 is going to have a metal around the whole phone and some people are completely disappointed that it might dis, uh, mess up the water resistant but in my opinion I don't think it does at all. So another thing that's going to probably going to be announced this year is going to be the Samsung Galaxy S Edge. And by far at this moment that you've seen by Keynote that we have no idea what exactly was going to be coming out but it's going to be coming out pretty soon on the Barcelona, Spain and the NSW 2015. So we're hoping that we get to see something really massive, really impressive by the new Samsung Galaxy S Edge because a lot of people have been completely been going over again the hands on that phone more than the Samsung Galaxy S5 and the Galaxy S Note, which is kind of impressive to me. And I was actually kind of really shocked that a lot of people actually choose that phone over than the others. So the last one for this list is the software. Lollipop this year is going to come out on the Samsung Galaxy S6 which I'm completely looking forward to this one but we still have a touch with the situation coming down that Samsung has been completely been doing and since the camp since the vibrant but at this current moment stage that we have to see what exactly are they going to be doing on the interface to make sure to see if there's going to be any kind of sort of changes which I'm expecting for it to happen but like I said before Lollipop is one of the big deal right now for the Android 5.0 so let's see what to expect when the press conference comes up in Barcelona Spain. So anyway guys, leave a comment down below, tell me what you think about the video, if you like what you just saw, if you tell me what you like about the Samsung Galaxy S6, if it's coming out, what you expect it to come out, or you expect something else different to come out, which I'm not too sure what to expect to come out, because they could always change things, always at the last minute, because they always do every single year. Be the cool guys to give it a thumbs up and to subscribe to my channel for more contents like this. Thank you for watching, I'm Saxon Tech, and I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace.